What's up, guys? Happy Monday. Thanks for tuning in to yet another episode of My Basic Ass Life. And I'm coming to you loud, live, and in color from my front porch. About to go with my mama to do some, run some errands and do some stuff. And I decided I'm going to take you guys along with me. So, welcome to it, guys. How y'all doing? Mama, my all, what would you think of it? We've been on this long road accumulating luggage. And as time proceeds, preoccupied with everything, I think it's about time that we sing of nothing. What's up? We've been on this long road accumulating luggage. And as time proceeds, preoccupied with everything, I think it's about time that I sing of nothing. But y'all so hate mama. Say hey. Hello. Y'all have not seen my mama in forever, right? Um, so yeah, we're just in here just sightseeing. Oh, no. What? Is it a rack or is it dishes? Dish rack. I like this dish rack. And it's only $19. This is cute. And then they have a little thing for the water to drain off. Yeah. Mama, yo, the wind just does the wonders to your hair. <laughs> Why do you pat? Yo, my mama, when she does, like me, I like big hair, so I don't pat my hair when it's in the afro. Like, I don't pat it down. She don't like the wild look, so she pats hers down. Like a good southern lady. <laughs> you my poor mama, y'all. So, uh, I always say... Y'all, I always say, my mama is like, she's born, she was born in the wrong, like, century. Like, she belongs in 18th century England, somewhere. Why? She is so old, like, she's an old soul, y'all, a true old soul. I think that she, her soul was recycled. She's a recycled one. <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, now let's see if that was better. Yay, there we go. Y'all, my mama used to be addicted to Coke. I mean, Coke after Coke. I don't know what changed. I think I was getting an overload of caffeine because I drank coffee all day and then I was drinking Coke. Uh -huh. That might be the reason why I lost a lot of weight. <laughs> yeah. I was on a caffeine high. <laughs> yeah, and plus she never sits down at work. She's like moving all the time and stuff like that. So that makes sense. She's always the one time I have to lose weight, though. That she needs to lose weight. My mama is not even remotely overweight. It's, like, ridiculous. <laughs> she is not overweight at all. Like, not even a little bit overweight. It's not you, it's your clothes. Yeah, she does wear oversized clothes, but she's really not a big woman. Unlike me, who's chunky monkey. But I love you, too. <laughs> <laughs> I love me, too. Some things are just are, okay? I just happen to be fluffy. But fluffy and lovely. <laughs> but yeah, y'all. I'll show y'all if we end up putting anything in this basket. Because right now, it's real empty. <laughs> because I get a caffeine high. Yeah, we're talking about um, decaf coffee with no caffeine in it. And I just find it pointless. If it doesn't have the caffeine in it, why are you drinking it? Because you like coffee. But you don't want all the caffeine. Okay, but I'm not willing to pay $11 for something that's not going to give me a pick-me-up. Hmm. I just don't get it. That's just like Starbucks coffee. Like, I don't get Starbucks. It seems like Starbucks must sponsor every single major YouTuber that we have. Because every single one, they're like on Starbucks. Unless they're trying to get a sponsorship from, um, from Starbucks. Because all of them, all of them are like Starbucks junkies. And I'm just like, are they giving this away to y'all? Are y'all getting a discount from Starbucks or something? Because like some yeah. of them, what? We can do Hidden Valley Ranch. So let's work with Hidden Valley Ranch. Oh yeah, I wish. <laughs> I wish. Eventually I'm gonna have enough subscribers to get brand deals and sponsorships and then I'm gonna be super bougie. And then I'll be like, you know what y'all, I only do videos once a month now because I got money, okay? Yes, indeed. <laughs> I'm joking, y'all. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> you know how you can be super bougie. I'm already partially bougie, y'all, because now I have a, um, a fancy computer that is fast. Look, I'm going to go down. So I'm super bougie. Huh? Oh, now I'm going to go look at the, at the evil aisle of snacks. 
the snack wonderland. Mama, why do you want to go down this aisle of evil? Pure evil. Look at that, the devil in a box. Every single one. <laughs> Y'all, we about to go eat. That's something at the food court. I cannot do cheeses. Y'all, I don't like cheeses either. Do y'all like cheeses? Do y'all like cheeses? I hate cheeses. And the goldfish. Disgusting. I can't do the goldfish. Man. Yeah, I don't like it. When I have kids, I don't know what I'm gonna do about snacks because I can't even stand the smell of goldfish. Ugh. It, it smells I just, like funky cheese. Yes, it's 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 bad. So, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, see y'all when we get to the food court and get our food. Okay, y'all, so I got a pretzel and a drink, and my mama got hot dogs. So let me. These pretzels are so good, y'all. And she got hot dogs. Now, the funny thing is about the pretzels is that every time I come here, they never have any. Every single time I come, they don't have it. Just so happens this one time, I came and they had both kinds, and I was just too excited. But yes, we're going to eat our little snack thingies here and move on with our life. So yeah, we are in, we're in Walmart as usual. My mama is talking smack with her made up passenger side rules. Okay, y'all didn't get to hear the conversation in the car and all the way up to Walmart about the rules of the passenger. She's going to tell me that I don't control the radio, the AC or nothing. Okay, my job is to look at look for parking spots and keep a lookout, like we a drug like we drug dealers or something, <laughs> and I'm the lookout. Like, no, that's not how it works. I can't even I cannot deal with Lemurio today. Why couldn't you be sending in saying that it's so true that it's what the passenger rider does? That is not what the passenger rider does. So anyway, y'all, mom is tripping. So we're in Walmart as usual. We should totally own stock in this company because we're here almost every day. So like every vlog, I end up at Walmart. Ridiculous. But, um, wait, I want to get me some of these little. Ooh. Hey, have y'all had these? These are so good. These little apple slices with the caramel in them. I'm addicted. They're so good. Every time I come, I grab one. <laughs> Gotta make sure they're not soft, though. But I have no idea where we're even getting out of here. I'm not cooking. So please don't get nothing that needs to be cooked. Lemuria. Excuse me, are you talking to me? Yes, I'm talking to you. Hmm. Hmm. And your mama, the first name is not Lemuria. <laughs> her first name is Amy. <laughs> but I call her Lemuria when she's getting on my nerves. Lemuria. Mama, I don't care what you get. I'm telling you, I'm not eating it. They're eating it. I have a bowl of food left from last night. I'm going to get some noodles. Oh man, <laughs> bro, that's messed up. Y'all, don't y'all hate that? Like, I don't know if any of y'all who, who grew up, how y'all grew up or not, but I swear the dreaded thing to hear your mama say when she's like, oh, I gotta get something for y'all to eat tonight. And then the, what comes out of her mouth is, I'm gonna get some noodles. It's just like, no, why do you hate us? Your mom only does it to you when she hates you. Yes, yes, it's true. She's talking about that's not true, but it's true. Like, I'm telling you, noodles is like the meal of just death. <laughs> if I don't have to eat it, I don't want to eat it. But yeah, y'all, so we're just seeing what she's going to put up in this basket. Hopefully it's not noodles. Because really, <sighs> she's talking about we both going to be surprised if it's not noodles. Really? Y'all, she, she's... She is actively seeking out these noodles. We got them off of NCAT, Mama, so I don't know. Y'all, we looking for these. Well, she's looking for these little um tuna packets, like from Sunkiss. Ain't this a tuna at the very end of this aisle? Um, they like these little packets, and it's like flavored tuna, so it's like smoked and spiced and. Oh, that's all. Oh, Lord, y'all. Don't, don't, don't. Y'all, look at this. Y'all, they stop, Mama, so I can see you past you. Y'all, look at this aisle of noodles. Look at this. This is ridiculous. <laughs> There's some kids across Baton Rouge right now 
eating a packet of damn dreaded noodles. Absolutely hate it. But um, yeah. Oh, there it is, mama. They got a whole. It's still a dollar. Y'all, this is what I'm talking about. Look. This is a good time right here. Let me see. Really, so you gonna clean them out? <laughs> they have like herb and garlic. They have sweet and spicy. They got ranch. Bacon flavored. Let me see. Turn around. This is a hickory smoke. Yeah, she got hickory smoke. So, mom, watch out. I'm in anyway. But, um, so, yeah. There's that. And so, you know, my mama, she's like me. Once she gets to taste of something that she likes, she, like, eats it and eats it and eats it until she gets sick of it and then you don't want it no more. Hey, so, yeah, you? look at all these tuna packets <laughs> she done got. How many did you get, mom? Eight. Uh, you got how many? Eight. <laughs> Eight tuna packets. I don't think I have enough for all this whole thing right here. Really? Mama, do you really need eight of those? This is so good, though. Okay, I'm gonna get five, six. She'll get six instead of eight, y'all. That's her compromise, I guess. <laughs> y'all, now she's talking about so we not cooking tonight? As if she cooks anything. She doesn't cook anything. I'm talking about what she does is she tastes to make sure the seasoning is right. Your really? Is gonna be seeing this, and he's gonna think I can't cook. What's up, future stepdad? Okay, these are the, your requirements. You need to be gainfully employed. You need to not have small children. Okay, you need to be kind and respectful to my mama. Because if not, I am crazy. I will hurt you behind my mama. Like it will go from it will go from hi to hood. It, my chances for a man <laughs> was slim already. Now it's none. It's non-existent after that. <laughs> So y'all, anybody who knows anybody who's single for my mom, leave it in the comments. <laughs> and leave me their email address in the comments. Let's let's have a matchmaking service on YouTube, y'all. <laughs> y'all, my mama is great. She will make somebody a great wife. Okay, so if you have any single guys, all ethnicities are welcome. So what do y'all feel like eating whatever you buy mama so I don't really care what you get so y'all guess what? I'll see y'all when I come back whenever we decide what we gonna pick up because I have no idea excuse me so y'all we settled on chemicals so she bought them banquet like those banquet meals that's what she bought them they're gonna enjoy their packet of chemicals and be happy and love it so yeah, we're about to go check out. Mom, are we checking out right now or are we gonna go and look at something else? <laughs> Let's look at the hair section, see if they restocked anything since the last time I was here. Oh, I love her orange suit, that's so cute. Y'all, they have, yeah, they have a Nisha Islam lady um, in here and I love her little outfit, it's so cute. Can y'all see it, isn't it pretty? It's such a pretty orange. I like it. It's cute. Oh, cute. That's a cute little dress. I bet it's in, I bet it's in only skinny girl sizes. <laughs> I do like it. I like this blue. Y'all, this is my favorite color, blue. I love that color. These are cute, too, if you have small boobs. I'm sorry. You hear me, Mom? <laughs> <laughs> you heard me, Mom? Huh? These are cute if you have small boobs. What? This dress? I don't like that. This is so cute if you have like small boobs to fit in here. Oop. To fit in this dress. That would be cute. I have massive boobage and that's not cute on big boob girls. Like it's not cute when stuff is like spilling out and out of control. <laughs> They have some good, um, they have some good, like, nice clothes here. What? Feel it. That is, yeah. Yeah, look, this is like a little, I guess, maxi skirt type of deal. And it's like a thick material. You will surely die. Yeah, you will surely die in Louisiana in the summertime with, with that kind of cloth. 
Y'all, it gets disrespectful hot in Louisiana. So hot, so ridiculous. I hate the summer. I never look forward to it. Especially when it gets like, like deep into May, it starts getting like really hot. Oh, and it's hot, hot from like May all the way through to September. It's hot as fuck. Ugh, hate it. Even though we won't be here for the entire summer this year. What? What is that? Pants or skirt? I love it because I like the slits in it. Oh, I don't like that material. These little these little dresses like this mama that look like shirts y'all like these little dresses that look like shirts it's got like the thing that you tie and stuff I like it but I just feel like you need tights under it right you know what I don't like about it what number one it's very loose not no 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 see this right here mm -hmm. oh yeah if you, you have, have a stomach and then you gonna have that and that's not a trash well so. This is true. Y'all, I absolutely hate shopping. I will look at clothes, but I don't like shopping for clothes. It's right up there with boiling live puppies for me. It's horrendous. I hate shopping. It's horrible. Like, and plus, and I don't like to spend money. So, if I have to spend money for it, I don't want to do it. <laughs> I'm super cheap. Yes. Y'all, the plus size you always have like the ugliest clothes, especially at Walmart. Look at this. This is really bad. Mama, look at the cut of the bottom of this. Horrible. I do not like that. That is old lady. <laughs> so y'all be on a little hair, the hair aisle with all the hair stuffs. And I said I wanted to try this, like the banana clips. <laughs> my mom was like, you never done a, you never used a banana clip? Mama, that wasn't in my day though. Well, that was popular. Remember, that was in the 80s. I was born in 1988. <laughs> I know, y'all. I'm super young, right? I See, these, you know how I be sweeping my hair up to the side? You think these will work better? Yeah, because you can push them. I might need to get that myself. These are, I think I'm going to try these combs. What you talking about? It's like 12 in here. Okay. Well, I can get That's worth $2. So I'm going to buy me some of these. I need some gel. We not on the right aisle for that. No, okay. speaking of, I need to get a small tooth comb for the ends for when I do my twists. Y'all see me when I come places? And I just have to grab everything I see. I'm tired of buying combs though, mama. I have bought multiple combs, y'all. My sister is the accessory bandit, I swear to you. If you leave a comb, Siobhan, can I use your comb? Yeah, Chelsea, you can use my comb. You will not get that comb back. If you, Ch no, Siobhan, can I use some of your leave-in conditioner? Sure, Chelsea, you can use some. You might as well forget it. You won't be getting that back. Like, she is just like, ugh. I love her, but it's, it's team too much most of the time. Oh, okay, that's how you do is treat the pump. What is that? It's a what? Why would you want that? Let me see the style on the front. Hmm. <laughs> Y'all, this is supposed to make this home it's another piece in there that go with it but why do you want this i i don't understand that's not a cute style actually here you go but yeah why are these headbands and the ugly ones like that expensive, expensive. that's the one i don't get it because you can go to the hair store and get these same headbands for like a dollar i don't get like it these right here? do people even still I wear those for something because they're goody Goody is expensive. Well, goody, goody. I'm not going to pay $4 for it. <laughs> so. Now y'all see where I get my cheap from? Mo, this is not the aisle I was going on anyway. It was the other one with the natural hair stuff. Um, this is the, you said you wanted gel? Here's the gel. Eco gel. And such. What word is that now? Eco styler. But if you want edge control, then it's, you probably should get it from the natural hair section down there. But um, y'all, I have so many products. What dollar? Mom, really? 
She talking about where's the dollar stuff? Not not here. It's not. So my mom is over on the other aisle talking to her friend. So I'm going to take this moment to just say bye because once we leave here, there's nothing else. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Thanks for tuning into my channel. Um, please give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.